the other leaders have invited the cameras into their kitchens. Indeed, we uh, haven't seen your them, kitchen. Watch them, and you're not going to. And I'll tell you why. <laughs> you see, I think this. Being in politics can be pretty rough. You know, a lot of it, very nasty things get said. If you make your wife and children part of the story, you've effectively put their heads over the parapet mm. and they become public figures and they become fair game. And I think whatever I do in politics, whatever I get right, whatever I get wrong, I think my family need to be protected mm. from that. Although there is, a, there is a fallout, we've seen that, because you, you were having lunch in a pub yeah. and there were some protesters came in and, and yeah. your girls were, were scared. So they, inevitably that happened. Well, they weren't just it? scared, they ran away and hid. Mm. Um, and, 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 and we had to drive off with protesters sitting on the bonnet and banging on the roof and the cars being damaged and it was a very, mm. very nasty incident. But in a sense, doesn't that reinforce my point that actually my kids, my family, need to be protected. And I'm told by some people, oh, well, Nigel, you know, if you put your kids on telly um, and, and we saw a family breakfast, you'd get more votes. But actually, what's more important to me is the privacy that my family deserve.